Okay, welcome back to Demon's Souls, everyone. Now, in the last episode, I began the second part of the Shrine of Storms. Uh, this level, many f people find this level pretty difficult. Me, not so much. Okay, so we need to take this Reaper out. Not like that. But like this. And it's dead. I was worried that he was going to kill me, but it worked out. Oh, and I got the War Scythe. That sounds good. Uh, oh yeah, and I pressed the switch. Didn't mean to, but I guess it's fine. It just opens the door. Need to make sure if, if I have the uh, Grave Robber's Ring equipped. Or Thieves Ring. That's Grave Robber's Ring is different. Alright, Full Moon Grass. Anyways, I'm playing Demon Souls. I was playing Dark Souls, had to take a break from it because Menace was driving me mad. Uh, I don't think I haven't died to a boss that many times in a long time in Dark Souls. But yeah, Menace is really difficult. The problem is that because I'm playing a caster, he can pretty much one-shot me with any of his magic attacks, uh, his big hand attack. So, yeah, it's a process. I'm dealing a lot of damage to him, and somehow I only always manage to screw up at the last second. Okay, Bladestone, whatever. Usually I fuck up when he starts um, casting magic, then just when it all falls apart. Oops, don't fall down. This is where the... Oh, shit. Oh, come on, that didn't knock him over. I think this is where we get the white bow. Or is that somewhere else? No, it's here. So yeah, Menace, whenever he starts um, casting magic, that's when I just fuck up, always. Because it's always like, I have to heal up, because he just hit me, and then he casts those spells so quickly that I have no time to switch over to the silver pendant. And then he kills me. But anyways, I shouldn't be talking about Dark Souls during Demon Souls. You'll get to see all that uh, when I upload that episode. I still need to defeat him first. Okay, now let's go back here. Hello, oh, Patches. Hello again. Hey, don't turn a cold shoulder. I didn't mean to do you wrong. Really? Come on now. We've got better things to fret about. That pit there is filled with treasure. But, uh, I can't get to it myself. Go on, have a look. It's more riches than I've ever dreamed of. Yeah, 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 obviously it's a trap. Let's go trigger it. This is where, we re where you rescue Saint Urbane, if you want to. <laughs> How the hell does he expect me to starve to death when I'm in soul form? Oh, am I in... Th this must mean that I'm in white world tendency. Let's check out the Makoto. I think this is the sword. I think it constantly drains your health when you use it, but it's extremely powerful. Maybe I'll try it out later. Crescent Moongrass. Don't need it. Dark Moonstone could be useful. <coughs> okay, here's Saint Urbane. Heavens, did you fall for that little devil's trap? Well, I did the same. He fooled me, and now I am stuck here. The reverberations seem to suggest that we are connected to the outside. But dark, fearsome souls stand between us and freedom. But have no fear. God will cleanse us of evil. Pray with me. Umbasa. It's more like my meat cleaver will cleanse us of evil. Let's go kill this guy. Yeah, 
Yeah, there you go. Didn't mean to hit twice. Wasted a good chance to attack there, but whatever. I love how this thing just like knocks everything and everyone down. And I think it has like a little bit of an AoE too, from what I've seen. But anyways, that guy's dead. And that's where we get the Black Eye Stone to invade other people. Oh, it's you. Did you cleanse the world of another dark soul today? God has chosen you, and for that we are thankful. Umbasa. <laughs> So yeah, he's gonna move back to the Nexus. He's basically the advanced miracle trainer of the game. He sells Evacuate, which is actually really useful, but costs like 30 or 40,000 souls, so... Uh, I'm not gonna get it, even though it is really good. God, I'm so tempted to kill this guy. You, you. Hey, look, I'm really sorry. I didn't mean what I said. Well, I mean, a man's got to make a living, right? Here, look. I can make up for it. There aren't many humans like us. We need to stick together. I know. Here, take this as a token of my friendship. You've seen one of these before, surely. Yeah, he gives you a useless ring. Anyways, I'm not gonna kill him because that would fuck up my tendency. Maybe when I get back to the Nexus, uh, before I take on the final boss, I'll kill Patches. Just as revenge. Bow and arrow would be really good here, but I don't have one. Anyways, luckily these guys are extremely weak to... A hammer type weapons and as I've said before for some reason the meat cleaver is classified as a hammer that was really badly timed all right you're dead now these big guys let's see do I have I don't I only have the white bone me 24 dexterity. How much dexterity do I have? Wow, I'm nowhere near close. Okay, we're gonna have to do this. Hmm, you know what? We might as well use these. So remains actually kind of distract them. Oops. Okay, that one fell off. And this one's dead. Well, that went a lot better than I expected it to. These guys can be kind of annoying. And I'm only 8 minutes in, so I might get pretty far in this level. But this is where the annoying part is coming up. these laser guys here. And they're gonna respawn, so we need to go kill their Grim Reaper ASAP. It's better if I just block it. Or I can get close enough to them to take care of it. Nearly fell off there, but whatever. Alright, that was good. Now all we need to do is survive one more. Yeah, this is a trap too. This thing will ambush you. Don't need the dagger. Where is it? Just so that I, it doesn't take up space. I want to try out this war scythe.
Ah, it doesn't look too good. It's not actually a scythe. Like the traditional kind of Grim Reaper scythe. Which is kind of a shame. Okay, this is another trap. Oh, they backstabbed me? Wow, that was fast. I didn't know they could get to me this quickly. But you're dead. Shouldn't be really using late moon grass for these guys. Okay, we're gonna need some more soul remains. Or not. I thought there were two of those gold guys up here. Oh no, that's only if you're in Blackwell Tendency. That's it. What the hell was that? Whoa, watch out. You can basically farm these guys forever if you want to. No! Whew, that was way too close. Alright. I'm moving through this level extremely fast. This meat cleaver, holy shit. It's powerful. Okay, so... I'm almost up to the old hero. Alright, this part... Can just sprint through. I think these guys explode. Yeah, sticky white stuff. No, don't fall in. These slugs, they drop some upgrade stone. I don't know which one. And yeah, these white orbs don't get too close to them. Just gonna get through here. Alright. Am I up to the old hero already? I think he's just in here, isn't he? Well, I'm gonna take him on. He's not actually too difficult if you uh, have the Thieves Ring on. Just get Late Moon Grass out, just in case. Oops, I skipped the cutscene, didn't mean to. But we've seen it before. Okay, I'm dealing a ton of damage to him. Why is he going that way? Does he still not see me? I must hear like the crackling of my uh, sword. You do want to be careful because this guy pretty much one shots you. my turpentine is gone and one more I missed should be careful okay that AoE is nowhere near as big as King Lance wow that was unbelievably fast 14 minutes and I cleared this level. I, I expected to die at least a couple of times. Do I have time? No, I'm not gonna have time for uh, Storm Kings. But I do have time to go back to the Nexus. Spend some of these souls. That was extremely efficient, I have to say. Huh. Well, I must be on a roll today. As bad as I was doing with Manus, 
I'm doing surprisingly well in this game. Maybe this is just how it works. If I'm good at Dark Souls, I'm gonna suck at Demon Souls. And if I suck at Dark Souls, I'm gonna be good at Demons. I don't know. Hey, Bior. Alright, thanks. Hey, you lazy bitch. Come on. Alright. Might as well go for dexterity. Maybe I'll have enough to use uh, the white bow eventually. Wait, let's check. Alright. Yes. Should've gotten more endurance too, but... Ah, you know what? Who cares? Alright, now that we've got the Makoto, we actually need to go back here. Because if we have the Makoto, that means that Satsuki is down. And we can talk to him. Oh, you know what? Now that I'm thinking, I might not give the Makoto to him just yet. Because if I'm, th I'm thinking, if I kill him, that's going to reset the world tendency to neutral. But then if I go and kill the Storm Kings, that's going to set it to white again. But if I kill the Storm Kings first, then kill Satsuki, it will be easier to go to Black World to fight uh, Black Phantom Satsuki. So yeah, you know what? I'm going to do that. So let's good just boy, get rid of all of this shit that I have. Uh, white, white bow. Yeah, I'll keep the Makoto. Deposit the arrows. I don't need the helmet because I have no... We are indebted to you for you. I don't have enough equipment burden to wear it. And let's I just quickly repair all my equipment. Okay, maybe not. You come back alive. So, this is gonna end it here. In the next episode, we're gonna be taking on the Storm Kings. Then I'll be killing Satsuki. That's the agenda. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you all next time.